Hi, I'm Buddy with Gulf Coast Four Star. Today we'd like to show you our new Four Star three horse, 15 and a half foot short wall living quarters by Outlaw Conversions. Uh, the trailer is eight wide, and seven six tall. It's 29 and a half foot on the floor. It's got an 18 foot Dometic two step awning. This trailer, we polished the side slats on it. it gives it a nice appearance has a removable step at the RV door. But you'll notice the uh, RV door has a screen door also. Got a porch light, lighted outside grab handle. We added a uh, quick connect propane uh, deal right there where you, if you decide to take a gas grill with you, you can plug it in there. It's got the courtesy lights out here, outside speakers. drop down windows we raised what is called to the top rail it gives you more more airflow through here you notice the latches on these uh, drop down windows are at the bottom of the windows easy to get to trailer's got three outside tie rings on this side axles are 8,000 pound uh, we did block them three inches to give you more clearance going in and out of steep driveways or if you go off road it just gives you a lot more clearance so you don't drag the trailer it's got 17 and a half inch Alco aluminum wheels with 18 ply Michelin tires. Two combinations right there are the best you can, you can put on a trailer. It's got an eight foot uh, enclosed hay pod up top. Enclosure behind it is where the Odan 4000 uh, generator is. The rear doors uh, have a, got a locking uh, seal plate. This trailer's got a uh, permanent rear tack, carpeted all the walls in the rear tack. Got three, uh, three saddle racks, nine gallon fuel tank for the generators down here. Got two brush trays on the rear tack door, three swing out blanket bars. Notice on the inside of the horse compartment, the trailer's got uh, the poured in rubber floor, so it eliminates the uh, rubber mats. You don't have to worry about taking mats in and out and cleaning underneath that aluminum floor. Put shavings on top of it if you'd like, it's just easier to clean out that way. The dividers we put in we had them uh, put the bars in for better airflow instead of the solid dividers. Easy to operate, latches on the four star. First divider we call a, a stud panel, it's full top and bottom. If you want to use that first stall for storage, you can uh, stack it, hay up, feed in there when you're going to a show or a ride. The trailer's got mangers on the second and third stall. Pads on all the dividers are standard in the four star. The roof we uh, lined and insulated in this one. It's got three roof vents up there. We'll go around to the to the side of the trailer. <clears throat> we ordered this trailer with the uh, with a new ladder that four star come out with. Very easy to operate. Gives you a lot better footing when you're trying to go up these eight wide trailers and get up to your hay rack. And you just lift it up. And that's it. Here's where you fill your uh, fuel tank up. Here's the mangers. Plenty of storage in these two mangers. Drop down one that's on the head side. Also has the latches at the bottom of the window and the drop down window bars. If you'd like to get to your to your horses, you can just bring those down go up very easy. First stall has an escape door with, a, with an RV latch also, so if you want to use this for like a mid-tack you can. You can lock it from the inside. It's got a removable step at this door also. You got black and gray holding tanks underneath the trailer. Uh, there's your plug in for your power. 
this trailer we did put hot and cold uh, water faucets on the outside. It's your city water connection there. It's where you fill the uh, your fresh water tank that's in the living quarters. You fill it right there. It's got an enclosed front end on it. Uh, when we do the enclosed front end, we also extend that neck six inches, give you more uh, more clearance when you're backing up, hooking the trailer up. Also gives you more uh, leg room up up in the bed area. You got two two access doors and one large door. Under there, you'll see the 30 uh, 30 pound uh, propane bottles, equalizer, hydraulic hydraulic jack. Trailer does have electric over hydraulic brakes on it. Under there, you have your batteries for the uh, for the living quarters and the on off switch. Under the neck, we also put a light for when you're loading and unloading it uh, or unhooking at night. Put a stainless nose sheet on the front of this trailer. Looks good. Plus, it's easy to keep the bugs off. You just Spray some Windex on there and wipe them off. Put additional uh, running lights on this trailer. Now we're going to go in and we're going to show you the inside of the trailer.